Okay, good day. This is Chibuzo Ago, and you're welcome to Plugin for Tech Ones channel once again. Um, if you're new on this channel, I'd like you to hit the subscribe button, yes, and also the bell notification, so that you'll be the first to get notified whenever I release a video just like this. Um, today, we shall be looking at a simple topic, yes. I'll be teaching you how to download um, WhatsApp status, speed video, or pictures from your friends, just using the by just using the Phoenix browser app. Yes, as simple as that. Which means you don't need to stress yourself about downloading any WhatsApp downloader or whatsoever. Yes, you know much have been talked about WhatsApp downloaders. Yes, whereby you have to go to the Google Play Store and install the app. But hey. If you're making use of Phoenix browser, um, I guess you're yet to realize that the feature is installed in it. Yes, it comes together with the Phoenix browser. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to download WhatsApp status from your friends just by using the Phoenix browser. So let's go. Uh, the first thing, like you already know, this is my WhatsApp. Yes. The first thing you need to do, you have to like select, you have to like check on the you first of all have to view the status you would like to download. Let me see, let me pick a friend of mine. You ensure that you view the status. So this is a video. I'm actually, yes. You view the status. Oh you ensure that it is on your device. Oh no, let me select another one. Mm, okay, let me go to Mika, yeah. So you have to first of all view the status and ensure that the thing has and the status have been downloaded to your device. After viewing the status that you want to download, then we we'll now move to the next step. Now you now go to your Phoenix browser. Let me okay, this is my Phoenix browser. You have to open the Phoenix browser. It's opening now. Once you have the Phoenix browser, the next thing you have to look to is you look down downwards. There's the menu bar. It's just below. It's below the screen or the view. You look at where the right files. You tap on files. So now take you to a new window. Now the next thing you do at the top um, corner, here's the top um, row. After the downloads, you now see status saver, and you can see the indication indicated seven that I've watched recently watched seven status of my friend. Now you tap on status saver. As you can see, these are all the status my friends uploaded that I have actually watched from this device. Now to download any of the status. So downloading of the stats, all you need to do is long press on the image. Then once you long press, you now see a pop-up will come below, which is another you have to you have the option to share, to save, to delete, or to repost. Now I want to save it to my device, so I'll simply tap on save. That status or that image is, has been automatically saved to my device. Let me save this from HM as well. So I'll tap on save. Now to confirm, you have to close your Phoenix browser. You have to close your Phoenix browser and go to your image folder, your gallery. Now as you can see, you now go to other albums, yes. Which you see from the other albums, you see status. Now, in my status, these are the two images I just downloaded. So you can see they are now in my device, which means I can also upload them to my status or use the images for whatsoever purpose I wish to. You can see how easy it is for you to just download WhatsApp status from your friends without installing any other app. That is if you're making use of the, if you have the Phoenix browser installed on your phone. Um, if you're making use of your Phoenix phones just like me, I'm, I'm making use of your Phoenix Hot 8, you will realize or you'll notice that Phoenix browser comes pre-installed with the phone. And that's the advantage of your Phoenix phones. I don't know. Then if you're making use of any other phones and you don't have Phoenix browser installed on it, you have to download it from Google Play Store and ensure that you make use of the status saver found in it. There is no hassle or bustle. You don't need to install any other app. All you just have to do is to go ahead and make use of the status saver feature found in Phoenix Browser. So with that, we've come to the end of this video. It was a brief and short video. I don't want to talk much today. So before you leave, I'd like you to 
hit the subscribe button if you are yet to do so i promise and i assure you that the next video will be something worthwhile yes hit the subscribe button and also the bell notification so that you'll be notified when i drop the next video chibuzagwa remains my name i'm blogging for tech is the channel see you in the next video bye bye